this is Morgan is prepped in OR2. The Derma Laser people want your endorsement. I'm on board. Their clinical trials are perfect. Good. You have an interview at 5 o'clock with AMA Magazine, 15 minutes tops. What would I do without you? You'd be lost. Yes, I would. Mother. You want to take it? No. <laughs> Now remember, no horseback riding and no aggressive shopping for at least a month. <laughs> Can you do that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good morning. Ashley and Wistrian, 21st birthday. And how are we doing today, Ashley? Better now that you're here, Dr. Hamilton. Well, let's take a look. Three-day event or dressage? Dressage. I can't believe you remember. <laughs> Everything looks just fine. Thank you, Dr. Hamilton. My pleasure. Okay. Let's get this on you. How's that feel? Good. Good? Remember what I said? Mm -hmm. And you're all set? Watch your step. And the attendant will walk you out. <laughs> Oh, and happy 21st. <laughs> Yay! Uh, you know what I got for my 21st birthday? I'm guessing it wasn't a nose job. Nope, just a job. However, I did get to wear an apron and fill ketchup bottles. Well, after the weekend, you will be Mrs. Dr. Hamilton, and you won't have to work ever again. Mrs. Dr. Hamilton? Mm -hmm. That is catchy. I know. And I'm not quitting. Promise. Yes. When the Smith twins come in to get their ears put back, I will be right here for all four years. <laughs> you don't think we're rushing things, do you? We've been together four years. No, we've worked together four years. That's different. Although, they do say marriage is work. Are you getting cold feet? No. <laughs> Maybe just one cold foot. Wedding jitters. How does everyone? Not you. Well, if I had jitters, I wouldn't be much of a surgeon now, would I? You're right. You're right. I just, I can't believe I let my mother plan our <laughs> wedding. <laughs> you're going to be fine. Fine? That's what you tell your patients. When well, they are fine. Not Mrs. Zimmer. Mrs. Zimmer was not fine. She had complications. And what if... We have complications. We won't. We we have never even had a fight. We make a great team. Oh, and just... Yeah, there you go. It's better. Oh, your mother. Want to take it? Um... Sorry, got a nose to break. See you Saturday. Yep, I will be the girl wearing the long white dress. Uh -huh. Hi, Mom. last night. Oh. Well, I thought you were supposed to throw the rice after the wedding. We are just so thrilled. We thought this moment would never come. Your friends are all married. Your sister's married. I know. I am the last single person on earth. What your mother means is uh, if you're happy, we're happy. Of course she's happy. She's getting married. It's a miracle. Although I don't understand why he can't be here till Saturday. Mother, I already told you he has a nasal reconstruction seminar. Well, he, he can't change his plans. He's the key nose speaker. <laughs> wow. Well, I hope you two are still joking if he doesn't show up. Mother. Where's your ring? Uh, Philip took it to get sized. It was too tight. That's all. What are you doing? We're going to be late. Turn that TV off. Late? We got three hours. Mike, let go of my daughter and sit. It's the last inning. Uh, is it cool if I don't watch the rest of the game? What are you asking her for? Because he loves me, Dad. What's that got to do with everything? 
You know what I did before I was married, Mike? Slept all day? Anything I wanted. Fair ball! Fair ball! Yes! Yes! You don't know how long I've waited to see someone in this dress. Pretty sure we do. Oh, we do, Mom. Well, you could have worn it if you hadn't eloped. And that is why we eloped. Is that all you're gonna pack? Yeah. What else do I need? I guess if you want to wear the same thing to the brunch, to the rehearsal dinner, to the no-host cocktail party, to the sunset Chinese lantern ceremony. Mom. I know that you want this to be the wedding that you and Dad never had. But you promised to keep this low-key. You did ask Mom to do something low-key. It is low-key. It's just us and them. Honestly, I do not know what you're afraid of. Because she's not a wedding person, Mom. And you know that. That's mm -hmm. ridiculous. What woman doesn't like a wedding? You said a date, you get married. No, actually, Mom, you said the date. Well, was I supposed to wait for you to get your AARP card? Besides, the nuptial package is only good until May. Nuptial package? Oh. Mother. Hi. What are you doing here? Oh, I just thought we should talk without all those people around. Those people? Wow, you mean Georgie's family? You'll get used to them once you get to know them. What a delightful prospect. You might be surprised. Oh, I am surprised. Up until now, you've been the perfect son. Oh, mother. No, I just don't understand. Of all the suitable girls, you marrying someone like her? Well, I'm not marrying someone like her. I'm marrying her. Well, she's the exact opposite of anyone you've ever dated. Because she's not a shallow socialite or the daughter of one of your friends. I'm not calling off this wedding. Well, then postpone. Everyone knows a proper wedding takes a year and a half to plan. Georgie's mom worked hard on this. I am the mother of the groom. I at least should have been consulted. <clears throat> As I recall, you were too busy. Well, I'll tell you one thing. I wouldn't have forced my guests to travel. It's less than an hour away. You've driven farther for a pair of shoes. I know this is difficult for you. I know that you feel alone since father died. You're not losing a son. You're, you're gaining a daughter. As they say. Okay. But I will pick you up on Saturday. I'll be counting the moments. Love you. Love you. Hey, Beth. Come on time. I know where he is. Well, I'll be here Tuesday. No? I plan on it. Great, perfect. Hey, man. Sorry, I'm late. Lost your shoes? Uh, Miss the ferry. Uh, so is that how they dress in uh, wherever it is you're from now? I'm interested in my wardrobe, my sketches. These are good. You haven't lost your touch. Thanks. All right, I'll set up a client dinner. Friday night, St. Michelle's. Uh, yeah, I can't that night. I got plans. Yeah, that's that's not gonna cut it, Luke. You went back in the firm, you're gonna have to do the dance. I mean, you were the best in the business, but that was two years ago. Well, three, for counting. Yeah, well, clients were puppies, not old dogs. Old dogs? You want the job? I thought I did. Put on a suit. Get a place in the city. And would you get a cell phone with reception, please? You mean become the person I used to be? It's not so bad. I appreciate your time. You realize I'll just find someone else. Yeah. Yeah, I know that. I'm not calling you again. 
Hope the phone don't ring. I'll know it's you.